That's the only thing I was, I was watching that Flat Earth documentary. Mm. And I was like, the dude's driving. And he's had, this, is the, this is the dude who was doing the hammer thing. He also did like all the states while he was doing it. He was like, Alabama, Arkansas, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so he's driving and he's like, hey, well, I'm driving down the hallway. Let me, or driving down the highway, I should say. Let me, uh, he wasn't that smart. Let me get you, uh, I got like a hundred books in the back of my car. Let me show you some of these books. So he pulls out like, you know, some Ayn Rand and he's like, that's a good one. He pulls out 1984 and he's like, this one, George Orwell, 1984. You heard of this? Must read. And I'm like, all right. I mean, that's a good book. Like, a holy I, Bible? I kind of think you kind of missed the point of it, but you know. And then, um, then right after 1984, he pulls out like this paperback that was written by somebody who is like they put doctor in front of their name, but it was like in quotation marks. And he's, it's like you know, on the subject of the flatness of Earth. And he's like, this one, oh, really opened my eyes. I was like, God, <laughs> fucking. <laughs> written by Doctor like Plain. <laughs> <laughs> Did you make like the most clutch Stephen Hawking joke ever in the middle of that part of my career? Oh no! You said, you said driving down the hallway. driving down the hallway, and then you said he's not that smart. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that was fucking amazing, and it was accidental, and I was I was hoping it was intentional, but oh, that's a great joke. Right. If you oh, it was so good, but it's like a little bit of magic's gone oh, since it was. Oh too wow! Soon. Should have just meant it. Come up with a name for a new, <laughs> very manly cocktail. Mansplain Ooh. with a twist, or Newt on the rocks. <laughs> Nut. Who amongst us thinks that a drink is manlier if it has a twist? I mean, who among us twist, man. Who among us think drinks are manly at all in mm, any way? That's it's valid. Liquid. That's Fuck toxic honestly. masculinity. Wait, I feel why? Like twists are not manly. Agreed. Yeah, they sound very dainty. Mm. It's like anything that ends in an eeny. What if it's a twist of a blade? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> it's like a side. <laughs> what if what if it's a plot twist? Yeah, like. Mmm. Next one. Yeah. They a drink. Sorry. Like, smack you in the face. Or M Night Shyamalan <laughs> comes up to you. That's the you're twist. adopted. Oh fuck! You would never go on a roller coaster called the Fiscal Cliff or Coaster Toaster Roaster Boaster Ghoster. Josh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Austin. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, bog, fog, grog, bog, dog. <laughs> you do have a good memory. <laughs> See? <laughs> Maybe I only have a good memory for animal assessments. I it? guess. Yeah, it fucking won. <laughs> <laughs> Incredible. Come up with a name for a rock band made up entirely of baby ducks. Quack, Sabbath, or ducks? Fuck! <laughs> Fuck! Fuck! Now that is Quack the best Sabbath. answer we've had. That's the one I was looking for! God yeah. damn it. <laughs> Just vote for that one, Chad. Don't even. Ducks of the like, Nexus. Just, there's not. Ducks of the Nexus is very good. It's just better. The Quack Sabbath is. Yeah, no, that's just much better. That's just so much better. <laughs> you are fucked if you're going up against Ryan in a pun. Oh like, yeah, no, I'm fucking. I was like, like a rock band that has uh, black in the title, and I was like, Quack in Quack. No, that's a song. Not quite gonna work. Uh, the first thing you would do after winning the lottery: hide or hide. <laughs> Did you see this news article, Kate? Study finds that smelling your partner's farts makes you live longer. <laughs> <laughs> a really good April Fool's joke on Kate. That's amazing. You should just buy her. Or no, I guess you could make her jar jars of farts. <laughs> Jars of hearts. Jars. <laughs> jars of hearts. Get your fart jars here. <laughs> what so is wrong with you? <laughs> because when she gets mad, you'd be like, I just want you to live longer so I can love you longer. And then she can't be mad. Mm, yeah, well, you'd be surprised. <laughs> oh. She'd probably live longer because, like, she would murder you and then not have to deal with smelling your she's farts. She's probably gonna but... live longer because I'm because... older and she's a woman. So already, I'm like doubly little cursed. This, oh, how is that sexist? That's well, statistically because sexist. I'm a man and I can live long if I want to, Ryan. <laughs> right? Are you gonna post this thing in here? Yeah, or? stop reading. I'm texting my mom. News, you nerd. Tell her I wow. said, "Hey, how's it going?" She's flying right now, so she can't answer you. 
Well, then why are you texting her? Because <laughs> when she lands, I want her to have this message that says, Shut Smell up my when I'm talking to you! Wait, Kate's flying? No, that's my mom. That's my a bomb. mom's flying. Are you going to get her a jar of farts? She was already... <laughs> she contained all the farts within herself. <laughs> what? The farts the whole that's time. why women live longer. They don't fart their, their life juices out. Yeah, they give all the farts to the baby. <laughs> It's just science. Facts don't yeah. care about your feelings. <laughs> Careful, with that one. Care <laughs> Careful with that one, Ryan. Are you going to vaccinate your kid? I don't know. I leave it up to uh, the child themselves when they turn 18. <laughs> oh, you know what? Here's what you do. You get like a nice fancy wooden case, maybe engrave it with something. Put three syringes in there. One is the <laughs> One's the vaccine. I don't care what you put in the other two. Eighteenth <laughs> yeah. birthday, you give it to him. And you say, yeah, "All right." Yeah. Yep. All I can do is show you the door. You must choose whether to walk through it. Time for round one. You'll get two uh, the other two are just mad. <laughs> Corey, when's your citizenship <laughs> test, dude? The twenty-fourth. Dude, that's soon. That's the day before okay. Endgame. A twenty. <laughs> oh, okay, got a good pop quiz question for you. Ready? Yeah. What was Canada called before it was called Canada? Adnack. <laughs> <laughs> He's <laughs> absolutely. Dude, quit spoiling. <laughs> Corey, do you? Does this mean if you pass your citizenship test, you get to vote this year? Time to vote. Uh, I don't know if it means this year, but I think I have to vote. <laughs> what? Wait, isn't that like a duty of the? I mean, it's like. <laughs> <laughs> the name of a painting Michelangelo was ashamed he created. The pristine polyp or the shitstein crapple? <laughs> Man. The shitstein crapple, Justin. Oh. The worst oh. breakfast. Pancakes, pancakes shaped like your dead family members or <laughs> themselves? What? <laughs> wow. <laughs> that is... Yeah, that's that's a bad one. <laughs> it's so bad. That's the worst breakfast, dude. Dude, I, that's yeah. way worse than McDonald's. Imagine how amazing it would be though to have a frying pan that like burned your grandpa's In face the into it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like that would be a real piece of craftsmanship. <laughs> well, if you had, like murdered them with it, then maybe the invention would do that. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> He said invention. You went to the trouble of molding a cast iron pan in the shape of our dead family. A surprising thing to find inside a pinata. Mike Myers or Paul Newman's mango habanero salsa. <laughs> That's so specific. I would be really surprised, yeah. I'd buy both of them, to be honest. Yeah. He cracked With it open and there he is. Yeah, baby! Dude, a tortilla chip bat. That's nah, still a pretty bad really idea. <laughs> yeah, why did you? <laughs> you didn't think that one through. I was like, they go together, man. Structural support issues with that bat. <laughs> you guys ever I have? Uh... Could you even swing it without it breaking? I don't think Let so. alone <laughs> hitting something. What if it's yeah. solid tortilla? Yeah, it's <laughs> just like a, what do you a baked mean tortilla. Solid log. tortilla. Like, 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 like a, it's a like burrito. Chip. Just like, like real thick. Just like real thick bat. Of what if it's a cooked tortilla filled with meat? Oh and no! So a here's that. Yeah. You know how they make plywood? It's like layers of wood and glue and layers of wood. You know, Do that with tortilla chips. I honestly chips. did not know that. A bad that name for a brand of hot sauce. Tomorrow you'll regret this, or Paul Newman's mango habanero hot sauce. <laughs> the double dip, nice. nice. Scientists are shocked to discover that <laughs> other people have been having sex. <laughs> Only America is warming. You're a little bitch. They're nerds. Or Mike Myers is actually Paul Newman's mango. Fuck off. <laughs> I really like other people have been having sex. Well, actually, they've been <laughs> discovering the opposite. Didn't you see the news, dude? People are not having sex. It's true. They don't want kids. I don't know what baby boomers want. When the kids were having sex, they were like, they're growing up too fast. Now they're not having sex, and they're like, why are our grandkids weird? It's a whole, like, make up your mind. We have to have just the right amount of sex. Right in front of them. <laughs> you know what they say. Lib cucks don't fuck. Pardon me. <laughs> <laughs> Sir. 
Flash. Just a quick. <laughs> All right, everyone has ten seconds to answer. No. <laughs> oh, dude, quick flash, quick flash, speed run. Oh, fuck yes. yeah, dude. I refuse. Quick lash. If the answers are bad enough, right, you have to. All right, all right, quick lash. Let's do it. Quick lash. Quick lash. Quick lash. At five oh, seconds, you just yell. Oh, this is really no hard. No thinking. Done. Done. I feel like you guys are thinking. The weirdest oh, no. thing you can buy at the Vatican done. gift shop. The pill or the Pope pooping ornament? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, the pill's actually pretty good. The pill is an extremely great answer. How'd you do that? I feel like you don't sell that. <laughs> Wait, what pill? <laughs> Viagra. <laughs> oh, nice, okay. <laughs> they don't need that. Pardon? Because they're celibate. <laughs> Never mind. Actually, sell a lot. Joke. I have to stop. I have to stop right now, dude. It's a vow. They're taking a vow. <laughs> I have to stop right now, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's gone too far. Time to vote. <laughs> a mobster's pet peeve. A lobster Whoa, or a chapstick? Huh? I love speed lash. <laughs> Quick lash. Because <laughs> it rhymes with mobster. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I think that may sequel be... to a wizard's lizard is a mobster's <laughs> lobster. Mobster's lobster. <laughs> 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 That's excellent. It's also his pet. <laughs> his pet. His pet name is Peeve. Yep. Oh, okay. It's Peeve the Lobster. <laughs> He's fucking Dave. The worst name for a rap artist. Fucking Dave. Taking a piss or fuck fuck. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Yeah. I feel that. It can't be a real rap name if it doesn't have a number in it. These days. Should, his name should just be Lil Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, never mind. Oh, you get the bad There's gotta be at least one person out there rapping under the name Fuck Fuck. Oh, guaranteed. Oh. Look up, I, check out, like, Fuck Fuck lyrics. Google it. See what, tell me what happens. Yeah, Google Fuck Fuck SoundCloud. There's a band called <laughs> Fuck Buttons. There I've is, heard, yeah. I've seen them. I've seen them twice. Yeah. Now, they got their name two, from Mouse Mom. Bonuses are double the drama. Damn. <laughs> Doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> the strange place to go to while, while wearing, wearing a ski mask. A ski mask. School. <laughs> Time to vote. <laughs> no, I just. I'm just done. I'm not, I'm not even gonna pay any more mental energy to interpreting this clue. <laughs> he said school. <laughs> school is cool. <laughs> I'm in a really dark place right now, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, we're all there. <laughs> Maybe it's because... No, I won't. I'm just going to assume that it's a ski school. <laughs> <laughs> so ski through school education. School on top of a snowy mountain. Yeah, ski school on the weekend when <laughs> there's no school. <laughs> you can't just skate through life, this is a ski school. <laughs> Something a kangaroo might search for on Google. If it's real or not, or your ass. Fuck fuck lyrics. Oh, that's a Ryan joke. Real or it's not. It's a joke about me, yeah. And then your ass is also a joke, so... You're telling me, buddy. <laughs> you should, did you hear that from Dave? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, you couldn't hear him over the moaning. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck emote is that? It's over. That's lull. No. no. <laughs> you might not have seen it in your chat because you got me. Oh. typically it's posted oh, wow. after, after the streamer oh. makes them laugh. God oh. damn. That was like one of the most real, like good based <laughs> jokes I've ever heard. <laughs> Yeah. That's that's Those hard. They're only do. good when they're mean. Ever. Good to be back on Quiplash. <laughs> it's been a Fuck while. You. <laughs> 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 it's good. The worst thing about being a okay, billionaire: bunch of broke liberals hate you, or having to bring losers <laughs> onto my Twitch show. <laughs> breaking news! Breaking news! Walk straight on Northern Lion is dumb. <laughs> 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 that ain't so. <laughs>
Got him. Boom. Oh my god, this is the best fucking answer I've ever had. Mm. Oh, wow. Well, wow. I hope it wins. Or yeah, I'll be so yeah. mad. But all the good answers lose. Yeah, it's a it's a history of, of good answers losing. It's true. That's, yeah. I have terrible answers. <clears throat> what's, what's new? Wow. That was a very mean, Austin. Yeah, it's it's a running either. joke. <laughs> 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 running joke to make our friends feel like they suck. It's fine. <laughs> Pretty much the truth, right there. Look, he's <laughs> crying now, like, Austin. He's, like, are you happy? Come up with a name for a beer made especially for monkeys: wild turkey or prime ale. Mm, Bear, is this the best Prime answer you've ever written? It's so good! <laughs> <laughs> I'll vote for it. Uh, I like it. It's not a good sign that he could tell which one it was, <laughs> I feel like. That, see, that's the thing. Good answers aren't funny anymore. Yeah. You're telling me. I care, I care more about earning your respect than your laughs at this point. <laughs> I mean, it got a quiplash. Because it Wild actually Turkey won. was fucking horrible. It was oh, a terrible. Originally, answer, I was gonna honest. write Bud Light, but then I thought it was too easy, and then I ran out of time. That's Bud a Light. horrible answer. Give me your better answer, you little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> what little Bo Peep would confess if she got really drunk? Butt plug in, or it'll go deep. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you're aware, fellas, but I've got a long vagina. Uh, <laughs> you get in there real works, deep. If you work, if you read it left to right, it just works. <laughs> yeah. It's thanks to all the sheep. Never mind. Fuck. Code us, Josh. What's mm -hmm. the code? I J O U. <laughs> Not without my consent, mister. <laughs> that was such an evil laugh. That was like an evil villain, dude. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's not sharp. Oh, why didn't I t think of that? A rejected <laughs> phrase for one of those Valentine heart candies. Sick my duck or I J O U. I like that. God, I like that a lot. He's so good. I don't know, guys. I think I got a pee soon. Why don't you just do it? Cause I gotta play the Quiplash. Can you just play it on the shitter? You think so? Yeah. Who cares? It's that kind of show. The grossest thing you could find at the bottom of a swimming pool: Ryan's farts jar storage or Ryan's Sonicare. <laughs> Is that like nuclear waste storage? But, you know, it's Ryan's farts. <laughs> How would they be at the bottom? They'd be floaters, right? Why would I need to store something that's infinite now? In because supply. It would, you want to it save them for gas. later. Josh, you want because Ryan sharts every time, so it actually happens. <laughs> Ryan, you poop it every time? I don't know. I, feel I have like a problem. Even if, you, even if you do, like, it, I feel like it'd be hard to shart enough to sink it. Shot it real hard! <laughs> You're to blame! <laughs> Something they will probably never make a series of commemorative stamps for. Hillary Clinton or beavers? Dude, beavers are majestic creatures. They also they definitely have. Stamps. They've got beaver yeah. stamps in Canada. I would bet, <laughs> yeah, I would bet $100,000 on it. Here's Dude, the I'll thing. I'll take if that bet. If you're good enough to make it on a coin, you're stamp worthy. Do we have a stamp with Mike Myers, aka Austin Powers, on it? There's That's no way yeah, we don't have a stamp Canadian, with though. a beaver. Yeah, isn't he Canadian? He is Canadian. Yeah, it's, yeah. You wouldn't, yeah. Well, I thought he was British for a long time because of. Are the you accent. more proud? <laughs> <laughs> are you more proud of? I think the movie might have done that. Are, are you more proud of Mike Myers or beavers as a Canadian? Well, I'm more proud of Mike Myers, I guess. But okay, see, beavers are considered a pest a lot of times. Mm. So that's true. The, the fur trade did build our country. <gasps> yep. Like, if Dude, we didn't I'll... have beaver pelts, like, we could be some backwater like Sweden right now. I'll Thanks take your bet on the stamp, man. I don't think you got a beaver stamp. Dude, I would. I... We got a beaver coin. I'm advising coin? you not to <laughs> not to take the beaver bet, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Our, your nickel has a, what, a freaking building on it? Oh, yeah, that's so abnormal, dude. Well, yeah, you only we think it's beaver. normal because you live there. 
everything we use as currency has a building on it. I know. It's weird. It's boring. Why do you guys love buildings so much? <laughs> you put some of your natural resources on there instead of these buildings that look like a square. You have to put some beavers on they there. They all look Something the freaking really same. You know, the White House, the Senate building, the Capitol. They Why all isn't the... Mike Myers on your $10 bill? Dude, I would he support will be. it. It's Wilfred Laurier right now. Who gives a shit? The most no. German-sounding <laughs> word you can invent. Vermenkaden Bagenkagen or Schleiße Peggy. That sounds kind of Italian. That's a slice yeah. of piggy. That's just another way of saying sausage. Oh, Schleiße Peggy. <laughs> Would you like a slice of this Schleiße Peggy? <laughs> mm, like that one. Want to go back to the apartment for some Schleiße Peggy? <laughs> No thanks, I'm full from the vermin cotton pocket cotton. That's a good prompt. I like that Coming prompt. Yeah, yeah, that's, it's it's really ignorant. It's yeah, ha ha, <laughs> the Germans speak funny. <laughs> they just passed a law recently that's a really, really big word. It looks weird. <laughs> a good sign you're never going to be a professional football player. You're dummy thick, or I mean look at me. <laughs> What's the difference? I feel like dummy thick means you'd be a, a great yeah, lineman. Yeah, yeah, you could be a lineman, you know? I feel like that's practically what the fucking coach told me in high school. He's like, Justin, you're so dummy thick. Please play football. <laughs> Dude, that's if not your coach something... was talking to you like that, I'd be really concerned. It's <laughs> not something your high school I can coach. hear your booty clapping down the hallway and you <laughs> be able to stop those lines. <laughs> Justin, you're so dummy thick. You'd be such a good goalie for us. <laughs> oh, a real weirdo would fall asleep to the sounds of vote this if the other answer is Ryan yes! Isaac or a boomer giving commentary over a video game. Well, How is that a Ryan in. answer? <laughs> yeah, the, the rules are in. Oh, wow. It takes a lot of confidence to put an answer like that in. It's super effective. It's bamboozled to the highest degree. What to say to get out of jury duty? Presidents don't fight in wars or confuse dog noises. Hmm. <laughs> Either would probably work. On the subject of being bad at net or being mad at Netflix, whoever gave Ken Jong the advice to call his new comedy special "You Complete Me, Comma Ho," just Remove yourself from the industry, please. <laughs> I like Ken Jong, more or less. As soon as I saw the title of the uh, special is You Complete Me, Ho, I just went... That's a reference to Jerry Maguire that came out 23 years ago. And then also a garden tool. But apparently also his wife's last name. It's like I'm not deep enough into the cinematic universe to have it to be able to watch it. A road sign that would cause you to turn around. Watch out for shit or watch out for hoe. <laughs> All right. Sometimes two bad a, answers make is that one a, good answer. Is that a Santa joke? It's a Watch out for shit, ho. <laughs> <laughs> more money, more guillotine, or more hoe. Yep. Did you guys? I'm not even gonna bring it up. Right. <laughs> Santa's rich. <laughs> Go ahead. No, I don't even. I, I it, rarely will I back away from from something on this show. But how bad was it? It was. I mean, it wasn't offensive. It it was just potentially besmirching the good name of uh, our employers. Oh. Oh. Go ahead then. I would never. <laughs> because if if paying zero corporate income tax allows them to continue to operate Twitch and the Bounty Board, then uh, no harm, no foul, as far as I'm concerned. Hell yeah. Uh, Moving Jesus, on. do they pay zero? Pretty sick, right? Did you pay zero this year? I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to impress the Olympic diving judges, try a dive that involves a boner or <laughs> Y and X at the same time. I'm on board with the London. <laughs> it's a London. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, God, I was thinking math. <laughs> I was thinking like <laughs> I was dead. Yeah, you really want all of your dives to be in at least two dimensions. If they don't have combos, they're not worth shit. It's got to be Dude, if you could pull off a dive that is only X and Y, that's incredibly impressive. That's got to be worth more points. 
Absolutely. What sperm yell as they swim? Gotta go fast, or what are the controls again? <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> I get it, it's another London. Mm. Oh no, someone has a Sonic emote. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. No, that was that was literally day one of that trailer. Dude. I saw that in Twitch chat. People have got all sorts of emotes for intellectual property they don't own the distribution. Oh, that's the real there. Sonic emote. Yeah. Thank you very much. What that's, the fuck is that? That's incredible, man. The worst thing a plastic surgeon could say after he botched your surgery. I'm sorry, I accidentally <laughs> pot played, or I'm sorry, I accidentally the whole thing. I like lull with a question mark after it. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> <laughs> the name of the hairstyle that will never catch on. Hitler old or Hertler? <laughs> How did we do this? Why did that happen? <laughs> you versus the guy you're worried about. What is Hitler old? Because <laughs> oh, Hitler dude. Youth was a cut. It wasn't a cut, that was a... Hitler Youth is definitely a style of hair. Just get them all out, you know. I did it. Film the bathroom. Oh, god uh, damn it! Pop play, jerk off on egg cam, you know. They write themselves. Have a heated gamer moment. <clears throat> Give out your votes now. Oh no. <laughs> the worst mistake you can make while streaming on Twitch.tv. Everyone makes mistakes, brother. Jerk off on a pot play in a bathroom. Have a filter tab on r slash livestream fail. Probably some bad accent or recording in the bathroom. Actually, that's okay. Wrenches? Close your eyes. Wrenches? <laughs> a terrible name for a king. Dairy or... Fucking Dave. I just realized it's called Dairy Queen. Queen. Yep. <laughs> oh, I get it. Clever girl. Ah, I understand the Queen. joke. It's Burger King. Dairy yeah. Queen. The best way to tell if someone is dead, fuck them or if they, if they play auto chess on stream. <laughs> so does that, it's like fuck him, like don't even worry about it, he's dead dude. It's not like a command. <laughs> I don't know. Neither <laughs> or. That's the most accurate place to get the pulse. <laughs> yeah, take action All right, right Ted Bundy. <laughs> I think you might get your own pulse a little bit there. <laughs> I watched a whole documentary on Ted Bundy. Dude, the, the Bundy tapes? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Do we have oh, to? Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I had Damn it. Fuck them, guys. What the hell? <laughs> The worst Halloween costume for a young child, a baby or John Wayne Gacy? I mean, Gacy is spelled wrong, but I'm not gonna hold it against you. And also, it's John Wayne Gacy Jr. that was the killer. His dad was just a vacuum salesman. Yeah, that's I mean, why he's a, a bad costume terrible too. costume. <laughs> <laughs> no, the thing is, John Wayne Gacy was not attractive. In fact, the most noteworthy thing about him, apart from the murders, is his physically repulsive appearance. Which is why I, the, the Ted Bundy people should make yeah. another documentary no, about him stop, and be stop. like, man, you know, when you he's... met him, you thought he was just a normal dude, except for the fact that he was insanely hideous. Just an he's ugly crazy. human being. <laughs> I just looked up his mugshot and the flash is so strong, it made shadows of his ears behind them and it looks like he has a mullet now because what is that like a it's a ben gibbard lyric fire up the scoreboard oh <laughs> did you look up that one resonated <laughs> got, got him that was... seven people including two in the call are they had a, a polite little chortle <laughs> I had to think about it way too much to even give you the appreciative chortle for it. <laughs> is it, is it not Sufjan? The prompt is. No, that's. Uh, I mean, John Wayne Gacy is a song by by SS. Are that's true. That but the flash of a, of a camera making shadows of your ears. <laughs> yeah, that was like absolutely the most death cab song of yeah, all yeah. Or li yeah. song lyric of all time. Yeah, but the glove box should be called a glove box. Should be called the manual box. For the driver's manual, baby. It's me, Mike Myers. Once you finish writing your quips, you should ask me some questions. 
I'm really going out on a limb with this one. Yeah, baby. I go to Kate. I said, Kate, what do you want to do for dinner? She goes, I don't really have anything I want to do. 100% suggestion, Indian food every time. Because I can get curried potatoes wrapped in another carb, a crepe, mm -hmm. in the delicious form of a masala dosa. Yeah, dude. Similarly, samosas, my favorite Indian dish. So good. Masala okay. dosa, more like masala donta. Am I, oh! right, guys? Am I right, guys? You don't know, want to eat that. I mean, more come like on. masala uh, bofa. Whoa! Bofa what? Oh, nice. Bo bofa, bofa dosa for me. Get your own. <laughs> I, do, I don't know. I guess advice, I understand honestly. why you can't vote. But I feel like you not being able to control the future of my country is totally understandable. But because uh -huh. you live in the area, I think you should be able to vote for, like, Comptroller and, like, you know... Yeah, probably. Deputy Reeve and stuff. To be fair, I, I probably wouldn't anyway. Yeah, we get you it, Ryan. You're a socialist. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> you wouldn't have voted for, like, you know, mayor of you, the town you live in? I, I don't really keep up with that sort of thing. So yeah, well, me neither, like, except once every four years when there's a, yeah, like, an election. My vote would be super uninformed. That never stopped anybody. When people are too lazy to vote, I'm just like, in my head, it's like, I don't want to look at my phone at the community center. I'd rather look at the phone on my couch. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Chat, please vote. Don't follow yeah, Corey's right. example. No, I don't mean in real life. I don't care. I mean, like, join this game and vote. <laughs> <laughs> it's LBIX. Join up. <laughs> Something you should never stick up your butt. Little hug juice, a Sharpie, formaldehyde, or Ryan Sonicare. Sharpie's like two levels. No, it's not, because like that's yeah. what you do all the time. Yeah, Dude. but also it's like, why like that's, that's no sharp up your what... butt? It doesn't make sense. You just made me also... think of like a sweet James Bond villain. It's like Sharpie a dude, bun? he puts oh. like darts in his ass and then he farts them <laughs> and it like pierces through like a <laughs> plate That's glass like window. That's like job with his hat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you okay? And like on like his asshole too, like he sharpies in like a face. Ugh. Like he's got like eyes <laughs> back there. <laughs> you know? <laughs> oh. His name would be the brown eye bullseye. Absolutely. Oh, hell also, yeah. You, oh, are you okay? Are you okay? Can't be any worse than Spectre. I never saw any of the recent James Bond You haven't seen any of the there. Daniel Craig James Bonds? Correct. Never saw Skyfall's. one of them. Skyfall and Casino Royale are excellent. You, when you say excellent, what does that mean? Like, uh, they're great them. movies. They're but on par with never... the Mission Impossibles. Okay, so bad movies. You are dumb and wrong. You, but you've never even seen sh like Shawshank Redemption. Yes, we've so established like, I have not seen. You don't the know Shawshank what a good movie yeah, actually, is. That's right, Ryan. You know nothing. You don't have a baseline to pull. Right, I haven't seen the best movie according yes. to IMDb and correct twenty nine year olds worldwide. You you can't beat this answer. I'm sorry to inform uh, you. Every uh, once in a while, you just top deck lethal, brother. Uh, I'm sorry to say you you're uh, you're playing yourself into a trap card here. I don't think so. I should have answered Here's tax day. This would have been the final, <laughs> right. the final really funny version. Of Take it. any U.S. president's name and turn it into something inappropriate. <laughs> Lyndon B. Fucking, Abraham Dinkin, <laughs> Bill Clinton, or Jimmy Farder. Jimmy Farder gets all of my votes. Fuck yeah, let's go. I tell I, I tell you, dude. I tried to tell you. I oh, done yes. been trying to tell you before. Another accent on the show. Finally. It's a damn shame you thought you had yourself a nice in the hole. End up going up against good old Jimmy you, Farter. You know, I'm Lord something of I'm hillbilly myself. I don't understand any of that. You yes, crazy German. No, no, did I. So to speak. Your words don't make a lick of sense. <laughs> yes. I know. I thought yes. Abraham Dinkin was right. Ah, that's me. Who who are these men? I do not know them. Hell yeah, Austin <laughs> gave me all three. Fez, Angela Twerkle. <laughs> that's mine answer. <laughs> that's pretty good, man. I can't believe. Yeah, Linda B. Fucking was pretty good. It wasn't. It was no Jimmy Farter. I know. I thought Jimmy Farter you was. Like, you, got, you were robbed. Yeah. Zob. Dot dot dot. C. Yeah. Who put Bill Clinton? <laughs> <laughs>
God, this is a fun man. game. Dude, it's Quiplash. I, I only like I only say that because I'm winning. Yeah, I'm losing. <laughs> well, games are more fun when you win. Flash. Yeah, I, I only like playing Magic when I win. Oh, that's 100 percent true. Like anytime I lose, the person that beat me is just the worst person. Like they, <laughs> they suck. There's nothing worse than in-person Magic where the other guy gets off like well, other person, but let's be honest, usually it's a guy. And he gets off like some kind of nerd wombo combo that his whole deck is built around and he's like jerking off and he's like And I get a draw and that's a Niv-Mizzet trigger and the Niv-Mizzet trigger I do one damage to the planeswalker and having done that damage the lightning field doubles oh, the damage It's all real though! He's yeah. saying real things! And he that knows. gets a Niv-Mizzet trigger and I flip ah, over this card damn Niv -Mizzet. I choose to play it for an exile, and then I get another card up at the top, and you're, and he's like, like looking at you, like, huh, 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 and you're like, yeah, you got me. Yeah, are, are you finished? Yeah, <laughs> I concede. <laughs> Something the devil is afraid of: taxes, Niv Mizzet, John Wick, Georgia, pooping in the window stall, or jerking off at the sperm bank. <laughs> It's like my maybe the the quickest meme answer ever. Like Niv Mizzet was out within five seconds. Yep, yep. <laughs> yeah, but whoever wrote it didn't realize Niv Mizzet doesn't have an apostrophe. It has a dash. Nerd. Oh, shit! No way. <laughs> yep. It does have a ah. Oh, it's hyphenated. No. <laughs> that was like a falling away no. Like, <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh no. Barry, you can't run for president. Why not? You're too young. Nah. -uh. Mm-hmm. I'm 35 yeah. somewhere. That's what. Uh, that's, I don't know oh, if that's how time works. Name? Do they Jimmy let Buffett said. Jimmy Buffett? Yeah. Yeah. Do Jimmy they Buffett. let? Ex... I'm 35 somewhere. <laughs> Do they let ex Mormons run? Mm. Yeah, uh, I mean Romney. Jimmy or Jimmy Mitt Romney did. Jimmy Romney Jimmy did. Wait, did. You remember when Jimmy Romney ran? Yeah. They let Jimmy Mormons run. They just don't. Go, little Jimmy Romney. He was a good guy. I'd vote for him if his name was Jimmy Romney. That would that would sway me a lot more. I used to go down to the pop shop with him and we talk about complex economical models. Hello. Hey, Can someone going? run for president in two countries? Mm. I'm gonna. Can someone pay tax in one country? <laughs> Shh, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> vote for me in the Canadian election. Um, I probably would not vote for you, but it's not meant to be like an insult. I learned where Newfoundland is, and I think I learned how to pronounce well, it, Well, that too. puts you oh, ahead of about 65% so of the parties. Okay. <laughs> okay, out of the it's six of us right. here... Oh, no, out of the four American people here, who mm. would you vote for president? Malf and Ryan. Go. Uh, Malf or scared. Ryan? Dude, now I'm going to get really actually offended if I'm not the candidate. Like, honestly, uh, I don't want to offend... There's <laughs> a homeowner, so probably him. I'd probably go Bear too, to be honest. I would honest definitely with you. choose Bear. Thank wow. you. Seems like he's got the best head on his shoulders. I don't shoulders trust. At all, wow. I don't. Well, Corey, I don't know about you. You're a wild card. But Austin <laughs> and Rob, I don't trust you to keep the revolution at bay. I decree today is no pants day. From now well, on, no pants allowed in the United States. I just worry that, you, Rob, you'd be in the Oval Office and you'd be like, do you see this shit? And it would be like an R Today I Learned post. And, and it would be like, you know. I mean, that's basically what we have right now. Starting it's today, so it's <laughs> war on Can sea it beat otters. That much worse? I was literally going to say, isn't that yeah. just a better version of what we have now? <laughs> Pretty much. No, I would never I... vote for Justin to be uh, a president either. Look, at least you didn't vote for Justin last time. What? All right, I, <laughs> I wouldn't mind if if Justin had one seat in the Senate, but I would never vote for him as the de facto leader. <laughs> and that's okay. He would definitely grind up the rich into mulch. I, it would be bad. So, yeah, and Dude, like all and the I cops would, would give their guns to homeless people, I think, and then. <laughs> I don't know what would happen after that, but it would be, I would be out. He and I would have fierce debates in the Oval Office during my administration, but I would respect the hell out of him. Yeah, he could be like the whip or something like that. The Senate Ooh, yeah, yeah, I could see that, yeah. Whip the rich. <laughs> Some of them like that, but yeah. seriously, though. Yeah, it's <laughs> You can probably get away with choke the rich. I hear that's a big. Mm -hmm. thing I think we should bring the guillotine back. You know, it works well. Choke for us. I can definitely never. 
<laughs> Dude, apparently a finger in the crack is what Robert Kraft is all about. Really? I've heard that, yeah. That was what I read on Twitter today. That was what Twitter decided I should read. And I'm proud to be an American. <laughs> I would vote one for Malf to be the Canadian one. Prime Minister, the though. Part about the hell's yeah, brother. I think he'd, he'd have a steady hand on the rudder. Okay. Nothing I'd let get you done. sit in my caucus. <laughs> <laughs> the I'm House of Commons. Yeah, bring back stonings. Yeah, that could be fun. I would not vote for Dan. Oh my no. god. <laughs> Dan, in our series with Mathis today, Dan asked earnestly, do you think some dolphins are smarter than human beings? <laughs> Dude, oh. how would I not vote for Dan? I don't think Dan should be allowed to vote. I don't think he don't should think be allowed that. to vote either. <laughs> Join the I don't audience. think he's wrong, though. <laughs> You know you're comfortable in a relationship when you ask your significant other to fart in her own mouth or Robert Kraft you. Could <laughs> Robert Kraft you? Does that mean he's going to pay me because I'm in? Nice. Yeah, probably pay you minimum wage and a $5 tip. Yeah, that's Turn me into point. mac and cheese? Is that what's going on? <laughs> that's a different craft. <laughs> I, will, I will not stand for this blatant mischaracterization of Robert Kraft. <laughs> he might be a good tipper. I don't know. Yeah, you don't know. The best thing about being really dumb. You get to stop playing auto chess first or wolf. <laughs> Got him. A ridiculous <laughs> government agency that no one knows about. The Department of Truth or the Department of Apartments? <laughs> I like that. It's definitely, awesome. I think, been made before on this promise, but I'm still going to vote for it. A TMZ headline you really want to see. Okay, Everyone famous is dead, or we got pictures <laughs> of Brad Pitt's butthole. <laughs> What's the difference? <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a pretty messed up, dude. What's yeah, the threshold? I wild. knew. Yeah, right? Too. Yeah, I was just wondering, you know, just, <laughs> just curious. A good use for toenail clippings. Oh, no. Putting them in Brad Pitt's butthole or... <laughs> <laughs> or refill your beanbag chair. You're so lucky those were back to back. You <laughs> motherfucker. Dude, there that is... That would not have worked otherwise. <laughs> Everyone is famous is that's famous is dead would make a great sketch where like a bunch of like aspiring actors get together but then one of them isn't there and they're like well oh they took Dave huh that's cool <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah yeah you know he's he's good he's been putting in work no you know I you know but, they, but I Dave was gonna die too but I just chose not to so yeah I, just chose not to. I mean Dave like you know he took some opportunities that I wouldn't have so but like <laughs> you know good for him. This is, uh, it's a controversial bit. Do you guys ever find yourself accidentally saying 9-11 instead of 9 a lot? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> we're, we're American? I know, but I feel like maybe one out of every 20 times when I'm, when I reference 9 I say like, oh, it's Reno 9-11 instead. Or like, you know, hey, do you know if that happens, make sure to call 9-11. Then no. people are like, what Grandma! Yeah. <laughs> Call 9 11! I feel like that's like, that happens midway through the thought for me because then I immediately change it to 3 11. So, like, that's, that's the halfway point for me. Isn't Canadian 911 a different number? Well, it goes to a different place. Hopefully. That would explain it. But it's, uh, we, it's, it's not 912 or 999 in Canada. Is 911 here? In Japan, it was like 119. Oh, dude. Just like, Japan. oh, you really? Let's go down in the right? Eastern Hemisphere, right? Oh, yeah, everything's reversed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so they read the other direction. Yeah. yeah, dude. You guys ever called 911? <laughs> I had to think it through. <laughs> yes. I did. Have, have, have. Uh, no, I have not had to do that. I've probably called three or four times in my life. One yeah. was I was drunk and uh, a party kicked me and my friends out. So I called 911 to give a noise complaint to the cops. You scumbag. <laughs> wow. Right, here's the board. Okay. He's a cop. The more and more I learn about Ryan, the more and more he just makes sense as a person. Dude, it ruled. <laughs> it's, it's simple politics. Once, 
we were down in our uh, basement and everybody simultaneously smelled burning plastic. Uh oh. And we were like, we got to call the fire department. So I called 911 and they were like, who do you want? And I was like, the fire department. I was talking to them. I was like, wait, well, hey, we smell like burning plastic coming from our walls. Can you come? But please, like, you don't need to put the sirens on. And they're like, oh, we already sent them. And legally, we have to come with the sirens on. I was like, okay, <laughs> fantastic. So then, like, three fire trucks peeled up. Like, <laughs> Yeah, and then they came down and were like, they were really shitty about it too. They were like, we don't smell anything. And when we pulled out like the thing that measures heat, the hottest thing in the basement was your Guitar Hero controller. And I was like, all right, well, this is a suck my own dick then. And was this your marijuana cigarette? No. <laughs> Dude, we had, uh, right before I went away from my old job, the, uh, we went to a glasses place to get new glasses. Lens and, uh, Yeah, well, something I like that. I thought you said classist place? A classist place? Well, what's the difference? Um, <laughs> and, uh, we were just, like, we're halfway through our adventure of buying new glasses, and this car drives up from off, like, it was right off the freeway, because the you just pull over the side road, and, uh, this old lady gets out, and she just runs as, like, as fast as an old lady can run, really, so it was, like, a really com weird combination of, like, her looking like she was running, but just not getting any ground at all. And she, she... Because <laughs> she's old. <laughs> she's old. Uh, and she comes through the door and she's pointing at her car and she's going, Someone call 911, my car's on fire. And sure enough, like 10 seconds later, her car bursts into flames. And <laughs> my car's oh my god. <laughs> and, I, and the fire, I had to call the 911 and get the fire department down to freaking make sure the car didn't explode. It was just a massive car fire in the parking lot of the Lens Crafters, dude. It's like, it could be like, you know, what's your sleep number? Or it could be like, what's your cum number? And then, it like... <laughs> An entry in Teenage Tarzan's Diary. Today, I Tarzan, or today, I Tarzan, her Jane. Oh, that's good. <laughs> I can't believe we had the same idea. It's <laughs> slightly differently. It's oh, no. the same entry every single day. <laughs> 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 Yeah, an entry in today's Tarzan's Teenage Tarzan's Diary. Today, I Tarzan. Yeah, okay. Jinx, today, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that was like the yep. third time in a row that's jinxed on the same. <laughs> you can't not put that because otherwise the other Tarzan will win. <laughs> it's true. On the 147th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me syphilis or a big sack of Sugandis. Oh, definitely. You got to give it to the one that follows the rhythm of the song. A big sack of Sugandis. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, uh, right. yeah, it worked. Yeah. I was in my head. I went to me. You know, they have that in Twitch Sings as well. If you ever. Uh, Syphilis? Syphilis? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't have extra money, an odd thing to use is a tip for your waiter small strips of the food you were served or a guide for how to beat Subnautica. <laughs> I mean, they're a waiter. They probably need it. You know? I like the idea of small strips of food. Yeah. Yeah, especially yeah, if you taking... ordered not stripped food. Yeah. Like yeah. a soup. Like they took the time to, to <laughs> cut it into small strips to give it to the waiter. I was taken to a diner once after a bar on an extremely drunk birthday. And uh, my friend told me that I took all my fries and just lined them up in like length order. <laughs> my oh my God. He was like, he was like, we all just watched you. It was amazing. <laughs> Just lined them up. <laughs> That's a great idea. Yeah. Sending order. I almost want to do it now. I want an order. Yeah, of I kind of want to get some fries. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, like what did Adam and Eve really do to get thrown out of the Garden of Eden? I don't know, but I noise complained their asses or didn't pay rent. Ba -da -ba. Now you do what they told you. Ba -da -ba. Now you do what they told you. And I want the control. <laughs> So he's playing it like inside out and stuff. How does he do that? He's really he's, he's slamming that wah wah pedal. Fuck you all, do what you tell me. No, mommy. <laughs> Fuck you, I won't clean up my bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, I won't clean up my bedroom! <laughs> <laughs>
The first thing Abraham Lincoln would do if he came back from the dead, go back to being dead or his taxes. Like he wakes up, oh, fuck this. <laughs> <laughs> I think he would do Civil War 2.0, dude. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Just for fun. Nate man would get even bigger in that one. Is he going to be the Iron Man or the Captain America in that case? No, that, that hurt me a lot when he said that. I just picture Abraham Lincoln with the infinity gauntlet, and when he snaps his fingers, it frees the slaves. <laughs> <laughs> might be too dark for this show, oh, maybe. What? That's, also, like, that's inspirational! <laughs> How is that dark? <laughs> I mean, you know... That is what? a slave joke at the end of the day. It's your country! <laughs> I know, <laughs> you Canadian bastard! Hey, did he remind you that he burnt down the White House? They worked on the White House one? I don't That's do true. that. I that was the that. British that burned down the White House. The most important thing is not who burned down the White House, but that your White House burned down. So hear me out. I'm not talking straight up war. Yeah. <laughs> but like, if you had America ver versus the United States, just a random what? selection of Americans. No, you heard him. Versus the entire population of Canada, one v one, fisticuffs battles. Who wins? Okay, here we go. There's some fucking Starting crazy Canadians off. out there, dude. Another I don't think gonna answer. Something it doesn't make any sense. You one v one, like one person okay, versus one, one person. Favorite. Yeah, that's what one v one means. I, uh, well, are you mean one country versus one country? I no, I it, I answered already. That it was one v one, the first one you described. He's saying the entire populace of Canada fights the populace of America in separated one on one fighting fisticuff matchups. Well, I mean, Correct. You, America would definitely win. You have like you have ten times the population. <laughs> that, yeah, like. Well, no, I'm saying like we match your population. Instead. But then, like, Brand once a Canadian flex. knocks one of us out, we got another one in the back row to you know fill yeah. in the slot. So it's like equal populations. Yeah, like if we equalize the populations, it took a random selection of Americans. Well, I think then the Canadians would win because you guys would be demoralized from losing ninety percent of your population. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. Come up with a name for a new TV show with the word Spanky in it. Spanky Sex Cult, The Dark World of Spanking, or <laughs> no. <laughs> I really like the second prompt as a response to the first. <laughs> I swear to God, if if no wins, I'm going to be furious. This one was not worth coming up with something good for. I figured that was you, after considering your reaction Monday to the Monday night. Rock. It's one. So it's fucking one. bad, dude. All right, well, my answer is just no on Quiplash from now on. Mm. Not going to answer you the gotta prompts. You got to deploy the no. <laughs> Not doing it. You got to deploy the no for bad prompts only. That's like the whole game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, no vote. Good prompt. Oh, the worst no thing vote. about Canada, Northern Lion. Lion. Oh hell rules. yeah! Well, that's that's the easiest thing I've got to with my heart on this one. I know, right? What's the <laughs> <laughs> Yes, you do. <laughs> Sorry, if you hear screaming in the background, my wife is not being killed. She's playing League She's of playing Legends. Playing League again? Yeah. No, <laughs> well, I, I asked this in chat, but like, why is she? Why not Dota? Because the Korean streamer she's watching. Uh, as well. Okay, but like, still, why not? I mean, it looks pretty fun. Cause yeah. Dota is like, it's got a billion things going on. Yeah, it's yeah. got a lot on the go. That's why it's fun. It's not why it's fun. It's why it's like fun to watch because you can watch someone like navigate all that garbage. But like when I play Dota, I'm just like, give me Cod of the Light and Josh, when you were tell playing me what to buy in the store. You were, you were drunk and you thought your laning partner was a sentry ward. Dude, that was the best <laughs> time I've ever that anyone. You're like ever me, me and this blue guy are freaking. We're we're wrecking this lane. <laughs> yeah. It was a good time, lime. <laughs> I would I would I would lane with that sentry ward any day of the week. <laughs> the first yeah. sign you're no longer cool. You have to ask what flossing means, or you talk about Dota and think it's a good game. Wait, what? I said the first thing. Austin said the second thing. And did we say the other things? Is this us? Yep, okay. <laughs> That's good. That's good. I'll allow it. A movie that should never be made into a theme park ride. Bird Box or Seven? So I wrote Seven, but I feel like Bird Box would be a worse ride because you'd be 
blindfolded. What? <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the ride. I thought of going with a pornography, the name of a pornography movie, probably. Seven Dude, that... has a naked lady in it. Oh. You're kind of tapping into something with this Bird Box theme park ride, yeah, though, because man. that'd be like the cheapest and ride of all time. It's just an audio experience, and you push groups through in fucking shopping carts in an empty hallway. That's what I was thinking. You play sounds around them. Just a bunch you know? of fans like blowing wind in their face. Yeah. Ryan, real quick. Yeah. How much money do you have? Mm. <laughs> Like, on, on hand, or? <laughs> so yeah. I, don't really, I don't really think about it like that. That would have been a really good time for you to leave the call like you normally do. He's absolutely right. Uh, Kate and I are going to be playing, and we're going to continue. The worst thing to receive for trick or treat. Notice of assessment or pennies wrapped in toilet paper to seem ghosts. All right, let me explain. <laughs> I ran out of end time, but uh, that was a thing I got for trick or treating once. Was pennies wrapped in toilet paper with a rubber band at the end of it? Oh, okay. okay. Oh, to seem. And then ghost? she told me it was a ghost. Yeah. Ghost. When you asked them why, they said to seem ghost, and you to said, "Oh, ghost. yeah, okay, sure." To seem ghost. To seem ghost. <laughs> I live in an Italian neighborhood. <laughs> my, my wife. One, two, one sperm a sure sign that a drifter has been secretly okay, living in your house. Your Fast and the Furious DVDs everywhere, or they kill you. <laughs> That's really good. I get it. That's really good. <laughs> Bravo. The worst thing that happened on Noah's Ark. Noah got lonely, animals can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> or all of the religious book burning. It's just, yeah, it's just, it's just feels bad, man, dude. It's like... He brought his family. <laughs> yeah, he wasn't alone. Uh, two of every animal, but then like 14 humans. They didn't make it. <laughs> <laughs> How do proctologists cheer themselves up? You ever seen a kinder egg? Or they turn that brown upside down. <laughs> <laughs> they shove shit into their own assholes? Is that the implication there? They just flip the ass over. Yeah, they poop it out, they flip it, put it and back in. And then push in it back in. <laughs> Alright. Uh, that's called a Missy Elliot. <laughs> uh, did someone just fart? <laughs> no, I didn't hear it. I thought I heard a muffled fart. <laughs> Dude, I, it's not me. I left my fart muffler in my uh, bedside drawer. Then we'd actually hear you fart louder if you Exactly. Did that. So if you heard it quietly, it can't be me. I only I have gotcha. two fart settings. Quiet or ear ripping. <laughs> I just decided to, decide, decided to stop farting years ago. How did you do it? <laughs> That's like... Just don't do it, dude. Dude, I still fart probably upwards of 30 times a day. <laughs> That's too so, much, dude. I feel like I always hold my farts in. Because I'm usually live, and I'm like, well, I don't want to yeah. be the fart guy. So, oh my god. I uh, I hold my farts in all day, but Babs told me that often in my sleep, I fart, <laughs> and then I start cracking up. <laughs> yeah, I think boy. that's really funny. That's that's I don't get too into it, but... I think that's really good. That is good. You get it, brother. Uh, Are you telling that... me though that you're cracking one out like once every 25 minutes? That's, I mean, off oh. off camera, I would say, I mean, there are hours where I could probably fart 15 times, yeah. I think you might need to stop. It, dude, it's been like this since no. uh, <laughs> even in life. high school. I was, <laughs> yeah. I don't know what to say. Next I don't, do. people are like, poor Kate. That's no, I don't, like, I'm polite about it. I go to the bathroom, close the door, turn on the fan, fart, and then get out as quickly as possible. <laughs> what you gotta do is you sit on the toilet and fart while flushing so it's what? <laughs> fart into the pipes. How Wait, did you what? have this answer ready? Ow. What's actually Ow. causing global warming? Ryan's farts, fart, fart, or YouTube gamers screaming so down, so damn loud? Did you inject this answer? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm now, trying to say. You so guys are faster. you are on a basal level. Malf seeded the answer before by asking, did somebody fart? He set the stage. Holy shit. Right. You've known him for a lot longer than I us. Did do just I'm that. extremely wow. mad, too, because YouTube gamers screaming so damn loud. It's Ob really good. Objectively, it's a better answer. No, I don't know. <laughs> I, I couldn't fart, fart. 
<laughs> the official medical term for belly button lint, probably. Fuzzy wuzzy. Fuzzy wuzzy belly jelly. Fuzzy wuzzy Aww. or belly jelly. Horrible. <laughs> Amazing. Something fun to ask the old wise man on top of the mountain. When's the beef? It's voting time. Or how much money do you make? <laughs> really like when's the beef? It's so wholesome. Do you have a plot? No, Where's the beef? Where's the beef? <laughs> Why is Gamora? <laughs> Holds up spork. In a no one ever asks how the discovered beef. That three out of four Sometimes people do, they go, how's the beef? That's true. Right. Right. Wins Halo. <laughs> ah, fuck you! Don't make me think about that. <laughs> oh. I'm not. I'm not mad. They should take their time making a good game, right? They've already right. made it. Wins Halo. You know, it's not even a good Halo rendition. was good Dude, at one point. I can show you a good rendition. Go to my Twitter. Look at the pin tweet. Okay. Hey Cortana, put the cube in my chest. <laughs> Bear, when does Spelunky 2 come out? Dude, I don't know. Ah, you fucking assholes. When? <laughs> what did <are> you <laughs> What happened? Spelunky 2 in here. It's not like Bear's been waiting for these things all his life. I thought you might have an inside line, dude. I wish. Okay, well, I apologize. You can make it up to me by telling me when Darkest Dungeon 2 comes out. <laughs> you can make it up to me. <laughs> I apologize. You can make it up to me. <laughs> Most Ryan sentence. <laughs> When's Isaac 2 coming out? Uh, tomorrow. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. There you go. They There's renamed the it. It's called Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Let's start with uh, Bear Taffy. I love you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, Nelson. Uh, <laughs> sorry, I just caught me off guard. You know, no one's ever said that. So the reason that I even brought it up is because I want to find out how the fuck Vince Young spent his millions of dollars at cheese at the Dude, cheesecake. Factory. I used to laugh at it, and then like when I went to the cheesecake factory and dinner for me and Kate was like ninety bucks. I was like, all right. <laughs> Makes sense. 90 it, bucks for two people? Yeah, there was like, there may have been a, well, okay. We did buy a cheesecake as well, but. Oh, okay. <laughs> Cheesecake's probably what, like 30 some bucks? Yeah, something like probably, that. Probably, yeah. And then I was like, Still yeah, if you bought bucks. the meal for like, you know, if you bought a 50 people's meals, as I imagine he did, and then threw on like a 20 grand tip, I could totally see how you could spend 50 grand at the Cheesecake Factory. I mean, you have to be a real dumbass, but like, it's not like a Brewster's Million situation where I'm like, hey, there's no conceivable way. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. This the worst thing about being a billionaire. Freaking cheesecake factory or caring whether or not people like you. On the 147th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a big warm glass of pee or <laughs> alimony. A double rainbow doesn't have gold at the end of it. Instead, it has gold gold or strips of bacon. <laughs> oh, double rainbow, yeah. gold, gold, okay, okay, clever! Yeah, but bacon... <laughs> mm. Oh, I wonder whose answer is that one. You know, oh, yeah. uh, ooh, the narwhal bacons at midnight. <laughs> uh, oh, I remember that. Yeah. How about you, Bear? <laughs> Ryan, how much money do you have? <laughs> How about you, Corey? <laughs> Come by, hang out, keep me company for a long stream. How about you, Bear Taffy? <laughs> you gotta give me another chance. <laughs> How big you dick? <laughs> <laughs> you know, hey, everyone, it's see Justin here. Hey, uh, no. hey so it's Justin. Uh, be sure to, uh, you know, we're looking for a few more signatures for that 2020 campaign. We're going to be... Oh, uh, don't you Justin. against me. We're going to be uh, whipping the, the rich. <laughs> oh, yeah. See, this is what I warned you about. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then afterwards, grind them up and mulch them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like grinding like a, like a bump and grind kind of way.
<laughs> oh, that sounds nice. Just for that, Justin, I'm voting for Ted Cruz. Oh, oh thank no. you. Right oh. in vote. How, how would you oh, do son that? Son of a bitch. Wait, what? Is he running as a Democrat? <laughs> <laughs> he might as well. Just put this the dash D next to his name. Ted cruising into the Democrats. Did you call him Dead Cruz? I mean, <laughs> that's Ted. a good that's a good punk band name. You should do I that. just can't talk. Ted Snoop. If this were a movie, that'd be foreshadowing. Bro, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if there was one time for the NLSS curse, I mean, <laughs> I wouldn't mind. Can't say that. Holy fuck. I don't He'll... support this. That's a MLSS curse. No, it's not. The <laughs> NLSS <laughs> wishes that you. Oh, no, would John just... Candy. <laughs> so a shriveled hand pops up from a cemetery in Toronto right now. <laughs> Cooler runnings coming out next summer. <laughs> 